was very interesting. Now, it's about 11 o'clock, I'm guessing. 1018 and the street's filling up. Now, the main part of the street is way down there. Uh, and it starts just, uh, looks like a block down that way, two blocks. That's about two blocks. That's where it starts and goes about eight blocks or so that way. You do. Yeah, yeah, we need we need it. So we're waiting for Spanky still. Somebody drank too much fire water. And we're out of here. But 1018 already filling up. Yes, there's more people this year. Oh, there's the new seat. Lock pouch. Huh. Oh, now that I'm looking at the seat, I see something better to look to take a picture of than that seat. Oh, there you go. Yeah, much better than the seat. I need a new seat, but I don't got the money. Hello, how are you? Interested in a what? Flat, oh, the flat race, the flat races. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we watched them last night a little bit. Uh oh. What do you see? Always oh, in a train set. Can't keep the kids away from trains. Hi guys. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm you selling your train set? Uh, I wish. It's not working right now. Oh, that's not a train, that's a slot car. Yeah. Actually slot lights. Where are you guys from? Uh, Idaho and uh, Utah. Idaho and Utah, I'm from Utah. Are you? Yeah, I'm from Right from Logan. Logan, he's from Logan. Yeah. Small <laughs> that's world. So yeah, that's amazing. That's too bad that ain't going. Oh, hey, I've been to them places. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, the, there's Cadillac Ranch. Yeah. You ever been there? No, I haven't. It's not what it. It's okay. <laughs> uh, seen the biggest chair. Oh, I'm on the I was on sixty-six while it was still sixty-six. Ah. Yeah, we did a little bit of 66. We were going to do the whole thing, and then uh, yeah, it's kind I of never have made it. Now it's hard to, yeah. hard to manipulate. So we, we did go see uh, Cadillac Ranch down there. Yeah. Seen a lot of it. Haven't been to Tulsa. Haven't missed. Mountain Lions, I think. I, I didn't think we've seen that. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Well, I think that'll be enough for town shots. Uh, he's right there. <laughs> what do you guys think? That's my new motorcycle. I just bought that. There's the sales lady. What did I pay for that? Fifteen hundred dollars? Yeah, he's my kind of liar. I like her. Look at that, guys. That is. Do they drag race it, or is it just for a running around town kind of thing? That is some designing in that thing. Yeah, it's got earless, so it goes on five inches. Yeah, I would have to. Yeah, I would have to. You guys don't have your diesel Jeep here this year. I mean, your air. What was it? Steam. Steam powered. That was a... Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a critter. Oh, we got a bunch of them here. Let's get them all. Beautiful bikes everywhere. Sturgis. This part downtown. I hear they're having a lottery. The, the millionth person that comes through the gates gets to pick one. You guys believe that? Still waiting on Spanky. Well, 
we're getting the honor to uh, put the flag up because uh, Chris there is a veteran. He knows what he's doing. Now that's pretty cool in itself. I think, I think he knows what he's doing. Uh, he's going to play music, so I'll probably have to cut out the sound here in a minute. It won't, it won't copyright Reveille. You'll be able to put that on. We can edit. Be recording this, Gary. Yes, I am. This is how you show respect. Young man there with his hand over his heart. My hand's not over my heart, but my hat is not on my head. Yeah, I should. I've never done it. Well, we're at Bear Butte State Park. The reason why they call it Bear Butte State Park is because the government took it away from the Indians. But they called it <laughs> something else because it looks like a bear. This is the bear's back, his shoulders, and then his head laying down. Picture that laying down. They call it Bear Butte. Yeah, I see that bear. Yeah. And it is a uh, sacred uh, spiritual place for the local tribes. You're not supposed to be yakking and talking and hooping and hollering up on that ridge, and we won't be. Uh, we're just going up there, and it's also uh, illegal to put ashes anywhere, really. So uh, I wouldn't put ashes up there. We wouldn't have done that, would we? No. No, we wouldn't put nothing up there. We abide by the rules. We always abide by the rules. But if I was going to break the rules, we'll show you where we would have put it, wouldn't we? Yeah. All right, we're gonna try. I'm going to try to walk up that hill. That pine tree right between the others is where we're headed. We might try to go further, but we're going that far at least. These are all gone. So, uh, now if I was going to leave something here, but it's illegal to do that, this would be where we would leave it if, it was, if we were going to do that. That would be a real good spot. That would be a good spot for it. That would be a good spot for John. Yeah. But his ashes are gone, guys. Did they go to the wind? Did they go to Mother Earth? 
We don't know where they went. But they went if somewhere they around there. here. Pardon? If they were there, they wouldn't be there. If they were there, they would be there, yeah. Uh, you guys know what I'm talking about. Well, you know, I'd go up there. I know, that's as far as I can go. That, that wanted me. Now here's, here's the view that John would have if John was here. You know, the first time I I saw the black tail. Okay, guys, let me tell you the story. I don't know if I told it to you earlier. I'm filming so many different cameras for different things. But one of my best friends, John, Hoagie, is what we called him, wanted to come to Sturgis. He got, he got all hung up one year on financing. And next year, he had his finances in order, ready to go, excited. Well, he had a heart attack two weeks before we left. During the heart attack, uh, well, he was fixing that, come to find out he was full of cancer. John only lasted six more weeks. So last year, John, in his ashes, went for a ride with us. He slept right next to me in the tent. You all know them kind of guys, that will, those guys that are just good guys to the heart. They'd do anything for you. Well, that was John. This is uh, very moving for me. Lost too many good friends already. But he's got a good view when it ain't smoky. If his ashes was here. And this is as far as I can go. I'm sorry, guys. My knees just won't take no me no more. They uh, think they improved this by putting these rock steps here. It is a difficult thing for me to crawl up this rocks. That's going to be even difficult or more just to get down these rocks. We're headed over there. I'm going to turn it off so I don't fall. Well, we're in the visitor centers here. You can buy your books, find out all kinds of information. They usually have a good looking woman here, but we got him. He ain't as pretty as the girls that are working here. <laughs> All right. Not a very big. Oh, you can go upstairs, huh? Yeah. And I ain't going upstairs. I've done enough of that today. Yeah, I'm piggyback. Yeah, yeah. Gotta go over. But you guys definitely stop if you're in Sturges during bike week or not bike week. Come and see this. Only six bucks for a carload to get in here and check it out, and it is really awesome. I love you, brother.